We have Vivi versus Gatsby, meaning we're going to be seeing Terry versus Captain Falcon. Uh, Vivi opting to go for the Cap or the uh, Terry over, uh, say, the hero, which I definitely agree with. Captain Falcon going to be one of those characters that just gets into your face and doesn't get out until one of you is dead. And that is super not conducive to the hero game plan. This Captain Falcon is certainly showing their moves. That conversion off stage was pretty nasty, but Vivi trying to get, you know, answer back. Oh, the knee almost landing. Oh, okay. <laughs> Gotta be careful with that. That is a low looking shield and using the uh, Falcon kick to catch Vivi trying to come back into center stage. Go meter now online, not able to convert off of that first down tilt, unfortunately. He, they they hurt box shifted by down tilting to not get caught by the grab and able to convert it into the Buster Wolf. But just like that, Gatsby yeah. bringing us right back to even stocks, and that is go meter off the offline. This seems like such a fun matchup. Just over, just as a spectator, just watching both of these characters completely annihilating each Absolutely. other's stocks. This is just this is two dudes punching. Yeah. One of my favorite types of matchups. Oh. All right, power dunk. VV going high, able to make it back, but we're right back into this uh, this scrapping situation. Go now online, meaning VV gets to play with a little bit more power. Does outspace the Falcon kick. A little bit of a delay punish, but still getting the Buster Wolf and also getting the positioning as well. Very great. close with the power gazer right there. Yeah, great neutral air dodge by Gatsby. Perfectly timing the uh, power geyser. <laughs> Gatsby's move was a little bit better. The Falcon kick getting it done. You know what's funny to me? I feel like every really good Captain Falcon main always uses the red skin. Blood Falcon is, pr is pretty right? good. Very popular amongst the Falcon players. I'm a fan of the uh, the dark green skin reptile. That's a good one. Absolutely. Dash attack coming through by Vivi. And right once again, like completely even stocks. Both uh, players starting at zero percent. Just a, a very like evenly explosive match. But right now, Gatsby's the one holding the explosions, getting Vivi to 100 yeah. percent again, and down air gonna be taking it. Nice game one by Gatsby. I mean, Gatsby doing a great job of taking advantage of Terry's recovery. And I think as the Falcon main, you got to really be aggressive off stage against Terry because once Terry Wait. burns their, oh, what you see? I yeah. want to go back a little bit. I want to watch this one again. All right, goes for the up air. One more up air. Resets. Look at that bait oh, on that the platform. Nice. That was so good by Gatsby. Yeah. Super clean. Oh, okay, Vivi actually switch. opting for the hero this time. Deciding, you know, all right, I got a little bit too blown up in the close quarters combat. So Vivi now potentially going to be playing the long range game. Which, I mean, like I was saying before, that seems very difficult with a character like Captain Falcon and especially the way that Gatsby has been playing. That being said, though, we do have PS2, which is, of course, a zoner's paradise, as we often say. Those PS2 platforms giving VV all the buffs they need to get that first stock already. I wonder if the strategy of going Terry game one was to sort of lull Gatsby into, you know, not figuring out the hero. <laughs> like, I, I, I don't know. I feel like Hero would do a lot better in this matchup than Terry, you know? I think, it, I think it can kind of go either way. I think they're both very volatile in different ways. Mm. I feel like the hero Captain Falcon in particular is either Captain Falcon finds a way in or he never finds a way in. And right now, nope. yeah. Vivi has locked the door. There is no getting in right now. Yeah, 100%. I know Vivi does a good job of switching between Terry and um, Hero, but I feel like the hero is just by far and away their best character, you know? I, yeah, I definitely think, uh, I mean, I don't know for certain, but Hero feels like Vivi's most played character yeah. at this point. Like, just in terms of raw hours played. And it definitely, it definitely shows up. Yeah. Accelerado online right now, which 
you know, really means that Vivi can contend with the same spacing that Falcon can. Obviously not the best frame data, but the speed. Yeah. <laughs> Another z oh! Not like that. Oh, no. Captain Falcon, rest in peace. That was so unfortunate. Burning the air dodge off stage and just falling to their death. But what a change of tails from game one to game two. Right? I mean, Vivi just completely putting pedal to the metal and just dominating game two. And let's see how game three goes. I mean, both of them, both both of them, I feel like have their fair share of advantages in the matchup, but I think Vivi is well in control of this Falcon right now. All right, so TMC is uh, the counter pick of choice. Vivi's bands were Battlefield and Kalos, which mm. I, yeah, I, I definitely agree with. Battlefield especially does not do a whole lot for Hero. Hero really likes being able to sit on the main platform, right. whereas Captain Falcon loves platform conversions, like we're gonna be seeing right <laughs> now. My goodness. Yeah, and then on Kalos, Falcon has so many cool mix-ups by wall jumps and all that good stuff. So, yeah, this is definitely a, a solid pick. Yeah, and I mean, oh, also there one to need. Damn. Yeah, Falcon, you know, doesn't even really always need the platforms to get those conversions. And the FD-like nature of Town and City sometimes going to be giving Gatsby just a lot of room to get in. Vivi right now not having the protection afforded Me? by the platforms. Oh, back air. Just the back air, oh. all it takes. That was a zero to death. Yeah, that was such a swift conversion there by Gatsby. You can see right now, Vivi, you know, trying to find some space for themselves in the world right now. But it's it's a Captain Falcon's world right now. Yeah. <laughs> there is no escape, not on the platform. Waiting for the oh! air dodge. If he if Gatsby held on just a little bit longer. Doesn't need to. Just what the down the? air off the side. What did we just witness? I don't know. I Gatsby that was game was over. Gatsby was fucking Oh, sorry. Gatsby was I, doing really well. <laughs> wow. Less that... than less than a minute and a half on the clock. Yeah, 5.35. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, I feel like just when Gatsby was able to just get one stray hit and you were dead. Yeah. And, I mean, that's kind of the, the scenario that I was outlining in game yeah. one, the potential Captain Falcon versus Hero, where it's like once Falcon's in, he's in. And yeah. he is not leaving until one of you is dead. Right. <laughs> Only one of us is making it out alive. And it's Gatsby that's going to be making it out alive into winners. That was only a winner's quarters match? Insane. People have to fight Vivi and losers that early? I'm so sorry for people who are still in bracket. That's tragic. Yeah, that's, you know, Vivi is going to continue being a menace down in losers bracket. But Gatsby really impressing me. You know, I, I'm pretty familiar with a lot of the, you know, the Captain Falcon mains throughout the game. I, I love playing Captain Falcon. Mm -hmm. uh, started out as a Falcon main myself. Uh, but... Gatsby really just showing that he knows all the tech, you know, Absolutely. doing a really great job of converting, uh, you know, grab into, 